This is Detroit Sports World. My name is Maurice Lewis. For the second round, second pick, the Detroit Lions select Tease Tabor. Oh my God. I'm kind of excited about this pick, but you know what? I hate it and I love it at the same time. Like, this guy is arguably the best corner and will be the best corner come the time to play in the NFL. But arguably, before the NFL combine, before the pro date, he was the best corner to come out in the draft. The best corner. Once the NFL combine came, once he did his pro day, he did horrible. But besides that, but, but besides that, let me tell you the reason why I love this pick. And let me tell you the reason why I hate this pick. The reason why I love this pick, Tease is literally probably the best ball hawk in college, coming out of college. Best hands for a corner, best footwork for a corner. He has it all. He has all the mechanics to be dynamic, the best. He has it. But... The reason why I hate this pick is because he doesn't have top end speed. If he goes against a top receiver in um, OBJ or um, let's just say he goes against a receiver that has a, a runs a 4-3 a, 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 in a 40 a yard dash, he will get killed in a fly. 20 yards, 30 yards, 40 yards. He'll get burnt. But He's perfect for cover two. He's perfect for um, short yardage, 10 yard, 15 yards. He's perfect because he's on it. He's a ball hawk. And that's what I like about this pick because the Lions struggled when it came to third down um, conversions. The, the Lions struggled in short yardage stops. They struggled big time. They couldn't stop anybody. This guy can stop somebody. And that's why I like this pick. That's why I love this pick. Forget that he runs a 4-6. And then in his pro day, he ran a 4-7. Forget that. I want you to look at the positive side in this. That he is probably going to be a number two, if not. And if he can work on his speed. Because don't get me wrong, this guy's very quick. Very quick. But besides all that. He could be a number two corner. He could be arguably a number one corner. It may take him a year to develop. But besides all that, he is a steal. But if he doesn't pan out and he, and he gets burnt, then you know what? It might This, this pick might end up being a bust, and that's why I kind of hate it. But it's also, also something that the Lions needed to address in our secondary. Right now, he can play. Right now, usually it takes corners a couple years to develop. Look at Darius Slay. It took him a couple years to develop into a number one corner. So understand that corners, it takes them a little bit while to develop, but I think he can play right now. And I think in situational plays, he can play. Definitely can play in special teams too. Don't get me wrong. He's a good tackler. He's really good with, QB spying, he's really good with coverage. It's just that he don't have top end speed. Very quick though, very quick. So I like it. I love it. I hate it. I'm in between with it. But you know what? I still think that it's a great pick for the Detroit Lions. And not only that, but you know your boy Bob Quinn is the man. So trust in the pick, trust in the mastermind in it. And let me know what you think. You can follow me on all social media. Facebook, Detroit Sports World. Instagram, De Detroit Sports World. Twitter, let me know what you think. Like, comment, I'm out. Have a good one.